Oh, righty then. <laughs> hey, <laughs> yay, it's Brucey hey. and Emmett. I know. All right, we're going to settle down and show. welcome to another exciting episode of Feel it real fun. fun. <laughs> That's a little better. Yeah. Feel it real fun dot com. Yes. Is where you can find the refunds. Number two seventy nine, Bruce. I swear to God, they're quiet and they're they're sleeping, and then we start the show, and it's like, thank God we can be on the show. There so there's Emmett. Everybody, look how nice he <laughs> he does have eyes. He does now. There's Brucey. All right. So number two seventy nine. Your questions answered live, starting with revision. I made a bad investment. And should I be repeating dot, 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 <laughs> join us now is yeah. where we look right there. Yeah. Well, yeah, Bob hey, Bob Virginia yeah, has joined. Yeah. Barbara's joined as well. <laughs> look at this. Look at this. I tell you what, we can really see them both. I like where the camera is. We'll have to put tape on the floor or something <laughs> to remember that. <clears throat> All righty. Lynette has joined. Oh, and and Kirsten, Kirsten, who shared an amazing success story in the group today. Go, oh, go, go. It was excellent. Are you Karen? She, she manifested uh, something, but uh, we won't talk about it here because it was there. So, Jacqueline, Barbara, aren't they beautiful, the dogs? Yeah. Barbara says she loves the dogs. Yeah. It was Brucey Boy's birthday yesterday. We forgot to sing to him on the show, we but we did go visit his first mom yesterday. Yeah. Yes, we did, and we played ball and all sorts of good things. Yeah. Stella Jim has joined Virginia. Our house is full of life. It is. It's, by the way, it's so cool because literally our house is made of mud, right? It's a mud brick. Uh, if, you, if you Google Eltham, E-L-T-H-A-M, mud brick, uh, you'll see all about the technology that our house is built from, and it's all big, heavy wood, as you know from the outside. Yeah. So Karen has joined. Michael has joined as well. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. So. Okay. Uh, Freenevel.com. Yeah. That's right. That is right. All right. So, Victoria. Yes. What's uh, the reader we've, email? We've got two today. All right. One from Natalie and one from Aka. Hmm. So, uh, would you like to read one? Yes, or both, I can read or that either? one. All right. Is it better to consistently visualize the same pictures with your wish fulfilled, or can you change the pictures of your same wanted outcome? I mean, like changing the stories. Is it better to make it very short, or is it better to dive deep into your imagination and turn whole movies. Alrighty, righty. So, real quick, if you go to freenevel.com, yes. look up segment intending. Just yes. type segment intending into uh, the little search bar thing by Neville's face, and uh, you'll get some goody stuff there. Yeah. So, hmm. I have a Neville Goddard story to share, Victoria. Do you? Yes, I do. Well, first of all, I reckon it's, for me, it's better to just have short Short is sweet. I can really stay in it and feel it and everything. When it starts getting too long and protracted, yeah. I just yeah. my mind mm -hmm. starts taking over. And so for me personally, that works best. I think I, for a lot of people, I, I it think works. it's universal. You yeah. Know, just uh, boom, that's it. Yep. Neville says. What does Neville say? Each time my mind wandered, I brought it back again until I reached the top, turned, and holding the side of the ship, I looked back nostalgically at the island of Barbados. For now, we were sailing. Hmm. Okay, that's, that's goodie, the middle of the story. Yeah. But what Neville imagined was... He also says, On that day, my brother carried my daughter up the gangplank. My sister-in-law followed, then my wife, and finally myself. They acted, but the source of their action was my imaginary act. So here's what Neville did, right? So yeah. he got in his chair, he made it into a little boat. That's part of the story. The other part of the story is he imagined... Okay, so he imagined walking up the gangplank. Yes. And any time his mind wondered, that's a good idea. How would I forget that? <laughs> and any time his mind wondered, he went back and did it, and then, you know, boom! You know, that day, the next day, yeah. you know, success, Bruce. I know, I love you. So short is sweet. Karen says, I agree. Victoria agrees. Yeah. Uh, Neville just imagined walking up the gangplank with yeah. his brother, sister-in-law, wife. Yeah. Right? Boom. Yeah. That's it. Okay? And if, and if his mind wondered, he went back. By the way, if you do it that way, it doesn't take long. Mm. Because as soon as you feel that's done, put, you know, go put another bun in the oven. Yeah. So, yeah. Victoria. Yes. Anything yes. you want to add into that one, or shall we go on to Akka's? Uh, there was one other question. Oh, ch changing it around, by all means. Like, no. Um, no? No, I'll disagree with that. You disagree? Just nail it. Right. If you're doing a scene and then 
Yeah. <clears throat> by the way, if you're not feeling your scene is real, change it. That's okay, probably that's, that's, that's more what I meant. Yeah, cool. for sure. Okay, got you. Yep. So, so get us on the same page, which is cool. Yeah. Because you know, if you're doing it, it's like, well, the scene ain't working for me, right? Change your scene. That's yes. Yeah. So for me, um, you you all know how with the cottage for me it was the click of the door. It was the click of the door. Now. Um, this will be good. There were other other things that I'd imagined before then, like just walking in and seeing, I don't know, like... By the way, notice the how long this or, is for her? Yeah, yeah. This is a longer scene, even though it just took a few seconds. But yeah, she's or it's floating. furnished or something. But it was like, it, it never, it, it was like, yeah, like it felt like a, um, well, what's the word? Daydream. That's what it was yep. like, th those sorts of things. And tell us about the click of the door. The click of the door for me was like when I walked out and pulled the door. Oh, so the door in the cottage had always been hanging off on its hinges and you'd pull it shut with a shoelace. <laughs> it wasn't it a was proper, 1960s It was a real technology. old cottage. So um, whereas for me when I grabbed the handle and pulled it shut and heard the click, it was like it was vermin proof sound proof. It was like... It had been done. It, w it was lock up. By the yeah? way, Which is for what her, we for. I, want, I want you to notice, watch the refunds. There's so much gold here. By the way, <coughs> uh, those who share the show, thank you. Those who skip watching the show and keep posting the same questions, watch the show. Right? Mm. Seriously. Mm. I want you to notice something. When Victoria is doing the daydream thing, yeah, I went yeah. in, I looked at the thing. Yeah. Okay, well, watch your body language. Your yeah. body language is yeah, yeah. Yeah, it'd be nice. But whenever she goes yeah. click, she blinks, right? Now, for her, this is nailing it. Boom. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> Do you want to hop down, Baba? Oh, kiss. No, <laughs> no growling in the microphone, especially a crazy boy. The beast is All right. So, so watch her because she, when she nails it, she knows. Boom. Got it. Mm. Right? When she hasn't nailed it, yeah, it could be this scene, could be that scene. That yeah. would be true. That would yeah. imply it's done. But the click. Yeah, yeah. Watch her. Bored at home, like you say, you, you, or like we've all said. Yeah. It brings it home to the belly. Yeah. That, that sounds. By the way, manifesting to the max dot com. Okay. <laughs> There's a reason why we share what we share in there. So, get how cool that is. Okay. She, you know, boom. When it's solid for her, it's solid for her. Yeah. And it's that fast. Yeah. So she doesn't have to go every night. Click, 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 <laughs> no. click. It's not here yet. Yeah. yeah. Click. All right. I'll go garden now. Yeah. Okay. Done. Right. And if she ever loses it, oh man, it's crap. It's falling apart. Click. When it's done like that as well, I really notice how much easier it is to leave it alone, not pick it up. Totally. Because, um, hey, because Neville talks about digging up the sea. How we don't want to do that and. Once you nail that session, it's like, um, with that sort of feeling, I, I didn't need to go back there because totally. I knew this is happening. Yeah. Th that, then you move on to another project. <clears throat> yeah. Very cool. Yeah. Good distinctions. Great distinctions. Great. Victoria. Now, yeah. I'll read Akas. Akas. Hey, TTNV, may I have a question? I have, may I ask one question on revision? Mm. Yes. <laughs> One only. I made a bad investment. Lost a lot of money. Do I revise it to having avoided that investment? Made a really good one. Made lots of money instead. By the way, I slightly edited this. Yeah. Or, another example for his question. I got involved with a person whom I never should have been involved with. Do I revise to have avoided that person? Kept them at a distance? Never met them? Yada, yada, yada. Mm -hmm. So, mm. the question essentially is, what do I revise? Yep. All right. Now watch this. We're going to tie in Victoria's excellent share in just a moment. <laughs> Neville says, Our seed time is that moment in time when you and I react to anything in this world. It may be an object. It may be to an individual. Guys. Hey. Bruce. No. Uh, Move. Hey. Back. Okay. No. It may be to an object. It may be to an individual. It may be to a bit of news that we have overheard. But the moment of reaction, that emotional response, is our attitude. Our attitudes are our seed times of life. Although we may not remember the seed time or the moment of response, nature never forgets. And when it suddenly appears in our world, dot, dot, dot. Right. So check that out. Mm. When Victoria closed the cottage door mm. in imagination, your reaction was 
boom. Yeah. Right? Yeah. I know it's done. I know it's... Hey! Sorry about the dogs, nice. you guys. <laughs> Leave it. <clears throat> yeah, notice her reaction to the world. Bang. Guys! So you can react to the physical world. Puppies are over there. Okay? Loving teacher, loving puppy, dad. You know, you know just takes care of it. Right? Boom. What's my reaction? It's mm -hmm. not going... But gosh, maybe they won't think I'm a professional or maybe I have to discipline my dogs or no, loving puppy, dad, loving teacher, done. Right? Boom. Get it? Yeah. That, so you can react in the physical world, your reactions to the physical world, but also your reactions to your imagining. When Victoria walked in the cottage and it was, yeah, pretty. Yeah. That yeah. her reaction wasn't real. Yeah. yeah. Versus when when you pull the door shut, mm. boom. Mm. So there's where you know, you, you know, if your scene ain't working, explore another scene. If your scene feels that real, but guess what? You really don't even have to repeat it, <laughs> right? Unless you feel you dug it up. Yeah. So. Very cool. What questions do you guys have, <coughs> Victoria? Uh, one you? thing I thought of Nathaniel, just because it reminded me. Guys. Oh, I can't. Sorry. I can't. <laughs> Was, um, <clears throat> it reminded me of In Manifesting Mastery. And I think just about everyone that does Manifesting Mastery loves this lesson where um, we just played with, I'm a millionaire because I'm a millionaire. Yes. And it was like, he's a wise investor because he's a wise investor. There's no, do you know what I mean? Yep. Like capturing that in it as well for him would be ace. So by I the don't way, know if Aka's done the course. But yep. Yeah. So, so that, by the way, isn't a mantra. When people make the mistake, they, they start walking around going, it's a mon yeah, I'm a millionaire because I'm a millionaire, and use it as a mantra no. instead of discovering why are you the way you are? Because that's how I am. Yeah. Why are you satisfied that you pull the cottage door shut? Mm. You're satisfied and you feel the click. I'm satisfied when I pull the cottage door shut and I feel the click because yeah. I'm satisfied, you know, yeah, boom, yeah. with pulling yeah. the cottage door shut and feeling the click. Yeah. Seeing the cottage didn't satisfy Victoria. Mm. But pulling the door shut, mm. first in imagination, and now if we went over there now and you pulled the door shut, what would you feel? Yeah. Well, the same as I felt when I did it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when I when I imagined it, it was yeah. like yeah. Yeah, you yeah. get she just did it. Yeah. Versus go look around over there. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's nice. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. But pulling the door shut, boom. All right. So we are professional feelers all the time, says Bob. But um, but perfection comes through revision. <laughs> so any other questions? Anything you want us to cover in the show, real quick, while yeah. we are here? Because this is our we answer your questions show. Yeah. And Emmett too. <coughs> yeah, he'll Look answer. <laughs> bada boom, bada bing. <laughs> yeah. So it's that moment in time where your reaction is. And you're always reacting to what you imagine and to what is perceived as out there. Okay, so you get to play with that. Notice, okay, reaction is a loving puppy dead. Somehow he got up in my arms. Okay, but by the way, we talked about free will in the group a little bit this morning. I think Lana brought it up. Maybe somebody else that I don't remember. But it has to do with, you know, what do you, how do you know what to do? Or, you know, that's the common question. How do I know if there's something I need to do or not? And if you just notice what's the state that you're in, mm. Victoria in the state of cottage done, mm. you know, love my cottage. You know, again, we can't necessarily even put the state into words. But when she goes there, it's the click. Yeah. Loving puppy dad, for some reason, picked this thing up. Mm. Okay? Or maybe it was loving teacher or a combination of the two. What are my reactions to the world? Mm. All right. Cool. No other questions? We're not seeing anything new pop up. So, no. going once, going twice. Are we still live? <laughs> Whoa. <Indeed. laughs> maybe we're not. Uh, yes, there someone's there. Boom. <laughs> okay. All right. Shall we close down the show and go to the dog park, guys? Yeah. Cool. What's done here? You just know it. You are not surprised or overwhelmed. You are calm. It can take a few seconds sometimes. Yes. Yeah. That that acceptance. How cool is it? Mm. So this morning, loving husband. Yeah. Brought Ooh, Victoria. Made me a coffee in bed. Made her a coffee in bed. <coughs> yeah. Now yesterday, loving husband was at the bottle shop. And I had a thing, if you bought like $30 worth of stuff, because I bought a bottle of scotch, they had a little thing where I could get Bailey's uh, for yeah. 10 bucks. 
Yeah. So it's like, sure, grabbed it, snuck yeah. it in the house, yeah. and put it in Victoria's <laughs> coffee this morning. Just yeah. a little bit. Ooh. That, maybe that's why I'm so talkative. No. <laughs> <laughs> maybe that's why. <a>, whoa. <laughs> so, it was only a dribble. It's just get, yummy. <laughs> the moment of reaction, living as loving husband, yeah. has me notice, should like that. I'll sneak it in. Should also like finding it. If Victoria would have made yeah. the coffee this morning, she would have found it because I, I hid it where she couldn't help but notice it at that time. And if she didn't make it, well, I'd make it. But either way, it's reacting to yeah. the world as that loving husband. So yeah. anything that you manifest up, if you want to keep it, you'll notice if you're still in the state by noticing if that's how you react to the world. As a loving puppy dad and oh, husband. We love him. We love him. We love him. We love him. All right. Okay. Victoria, yeah. tell them where to go. Tell them what to do. Right. <laughs> she go to freedomneville.com. Join us in Manifesting Mastery, <coughs> either by clicking the link there or going straight to manifestingmasterycourse.com. That's right. And for refunds of this show, well, firstly, what you learn, what you learn about you. That's what were right. your best bits? We'd love to hear all of those. May I ask a question? Please do. Toss it in, feed Yes. Uh, cool. <laughs> Bruce, leave it. Daniela said she's got babies. Yes. <laughs> I'll take care of them. Victoria, keep telling stuff. Have you got your question? I want a copy like that, do you? Yes, next time you're around. If we've still got some left, I'll give you some. That's right. right. <laughs> Where's so, our question? We're waiting. I can't remember who the person's name was. Fidra has a question. If it, if it doesn't make it up in time or if it's a long question, just yeah. shoot it to us and we can do it on the next show. Sure. Yeah. So, uh yeah, let's close her up. Yeah, yeah, okay. So So what you learn, what you learn about you, what were your best bits? And for refunds, share, share, share. <laughs> go oh. to feel it real fun. Oh, here we go. I'm curious. If one is imagining and one feels sad at that. <clears throat> How long does it take for some to shift from not feeling sad? Uh, any state has its com combination of emotions. <laughs> Right, so if, so, loving husband Excuse me. can miss Victoria when she's not here, or be sad that it's raining and we can't go to the dog park. So let's yeah. So I want to make sure we cover that. Uh, we don't want to be happy, happy, joy, joy all the time. That's called nuts. Okay. Yeah. So the second thing is, if if you're feeling sad, what are you feeling sad about? So that so that would probably be something in the past or something that you know currently is there. Uh, which brings us back to the questions. What do you want? What it would imply that you've shifted into what you want and imagine that? So, like, Neville wanted to get home. <coughs> yeah, he was, uh, he was in Barbados. Guys! Leave it. <laughs> Neville was, was in Barbados. He wanted to go home. Yeah. Okay, instead of being mad about it for a long time or sad that he couldn't go home, he says, right, what do I want? What would imply that I have my wish fulfilled? Done. And he moved. So there's the thing. So it's not how long. How long do, does it take you to move? And yeah. it may happen in a moment. It may happen over yeah, a couple of days, whatever. Uh, and, and by the way, if it takes longer rather than shorter, that says nothing about you. It just says whether or not you've moved. So if there's an upset and it takes seven seconds, a seventh of a second, or seven days, uh, play. There's the thing. And play with a lot of things. Yes. Yeah. Anything you want to add in there, Victoria? No, no, I think that's good. All right. And go to feelitrealfun.com. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> we love you guys. Have a wonderful day. We'll be back tomorrow with the, the Manifesting show. More Money show. Yeah. And thank you for your shares. We yeah. really appreciate them and you. And we might be upstairs tomorrow. Over the Tomorrow, weekend. over the weekend, over we'll the weekend. prep upstairs so that we can get away from the dogs. And <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay. Love you Most guys. Most it takes longer than I oh, missed that. Sorry. Okay. Right. See you guys. See ya. See you guys. <laughs> Freenevel.com. <laughs>